Legend 45 game, man. <laughs> it's your boy. Hey. Woo. Four. Woo. Five. Eight. You already know what time it is, man. Finish that. Hey, we bringing back Standing Slazy, man. Standing Slazy is golden, bro. We have to bring him back. Anyways, today, man, we're talking about Keith Daniel, man. Keith Daniel. Man, I don't, I don't understand, man. In Zambia at this point, it's like every artist that come has to leave some kind of story, man. That's the C had a story. Rema had a story. Now it's Kiss Daniel with a story. So here we go. Let's get into it. Okay, so Kiss Daniel. So Kiss Daniel was supposed to perform in Zambia. Kiss Daniel made his way over there. And upon arrival, when he got to Zambia, something happened. There's a lady who was there. I guess she was a lady supposed to be receiving him. Or was it just like some kind of organized thing? I don't know if it was the promoter. Or it was just something organized to welcome the artist. Because I know in Zambia we have this tradition where when an artist comes, you welcome them with flowers. I don't know who picked this tradition. I don't know who said we should start doing that. But we do it nonetheless. I don't know if we let the artist know beforehand. But Kiss Daniel got to the airport and he apparently said no to the flowers. And everybody's living. So I'm going to show you the video. And then we go get into this and that after. <laughs> Good, good. Welcome to the Mikis Daniel. What should people expect tonight? Tomorrow night, sorry. What should people... So yeah, that's the video. And if you are me, or anybody who thinks like me, you are asking yourself, what is the problem? What is the... That's all he did. I don't want those. I'm cool. That's all he did. That's all. That's the only thing he did. What's crazy about this video is at the end of the day, the security still had the, the, the flowers. You know what I'm saying? After he was actually leading her to the security, like give it to my guy. I'm not really the one who handles the flower getting and all that. You feel me? I don't know. Why you guys wanted him to go crazy over flowers? <laughs> I'm not understanding what's going on, bro. Ain't nothing to be mad about in a video. He doesn't, obviously he's not the one, the security guy handles the flowers. He gave it to the security the guy. The guy took the flowers with him. He didn't toss them away. He didn't, I wasn't, bro, I was expecting like him to be like, back up off me. What up with them flowers? Don't you see I'm trying to walk over here? But no, bro, all he said was, give it to my guy. I don't want those right now. Give it to my guy. And the guy asking the questions on the camera thing wasn't even like, he didn't even know, bro. Kiss Daniel was confused, like, what? What, is, what are you talking about? What should people expect tonight? Tomorrow night, sorry. What should people... So what do you expect people to... Uh, um, what do you expect people... Ask the question, dude. What are you, what are you... Bro, come on, bro. We didn't... First of all... To be honest, we didn't even represent ourselves the right way when he got there. And if anything, he didn't even do nothing rude. All he did was tell her to give the flowers to the guy in the back, fam. That's the flower guy, fam. But in Zambia, you're not supposed to say no to the flowers. Somebody, I think everybody just kind of assumed that he was supposed to take the flowers, which I don't understand. You guys realize there's people who are somehow allergic to certain flowers? There's people who are allergic to certain, like nuts can kill them? Certain flower smell can kill them or can give them a whole rash on the body. Do you guys understand that? So I don't know why you guys pick flowers. I've never, I've never even seen this before. I don't know how else other countries do it, but I'm really trying to know. Do other countries give flowers to their artists whenever they come through? Because I, I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know where this tradition came from. I don't know who picked it. I think it's kind of unnecessary to give somebody flowers. I think a good welcome is just, you know. Welcome to Zambia. The dude is already getting paid damn near, you know what I'm saying, to get on with the show. So why should we be giving them, you know, most people just say welcome. I think in America, the promoter doesn't even show up to the airport. You kind of just meet the promoter at the event. They don't really like show up when you land at the airport. You know, I don't know. I don't, I've never seen that in America. Like the artist coming from somewhere else or uh, vlogging or whatever, and they welcome them with flowers. I've never seen that. I don't even know if the lady was 
why wasn't she allowed into the air? Why was she standing outside the airport? Why wasn't she allowed into the airport if she was so official? She looked like a fan. If I was Kiss Daniel and I'm walking out the thing and somebody just rushes me with flowers, I mean, I would not want to take him too. I don't know who that is. You feel me? So, <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, bro. I don't know. You guys are mad at this? I don't get it. I don't, I don't get why you guys are mad at this, bro. Because... To be honest, fam, the man them could care less, fam. Let's stop tripping and being livid over something that doesn't make any sense. I don't think there's any reason to be upset. And if you're one of the people who are upset, you're part of the problem because there was no problem there. The man didn't want the flowers. Ain't nobody supposed to be forced to take some flowers anyway. So let the man live. Hey, fam, thanks for tuning in, blood. Slazy45 gang, smash that subscribe button. Smash that like button. Comment in the section below. Join the fam. It's the only lit fam. Hit him out, Woody!